Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to run batch files as an administrator without any prompt on your Windows computer. This should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So, normally if you wanted to run a file with administrator privileges, you just would right click on the file and then select run as administrator. If you'd rather not do that and you just want to automatically run it as an administrator, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Right click on the file, select create shortcut. So you can name this shortcut whatever you want. You can see the little arrow in the bottom left corner indicates that it is a shortcut. So we're going to go right click on the shortcut now and we are going to select the properties option at the bottom of the listing and now you want to left click on the advanced button checkmark where it says run as administrator this option allows you to run this shortcut as an administrator while protecting your computer from unauthorized activity go ahead and select the OK once that's done select apply and OK and now if you double click on the shortcut it should automatically run the batch file with administrator privileges so you do not want to go ahead and double click on the normal file anymore you just want to go right to the shortcut so you might want to rename the shortcut something and then put the batch file somewhere else just to kind of keep them separate if you choose to do that but usually if you're making a batch file it's pretty much goes without saying shouldn't be that confusing for anybody who'd be watching a video like this so pretty straightforward process here guys do hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye